kids, welcome to Funky Facts. I'm Professor TJ. And her sister Nelly Welly. And today we have an interesting experiment for you. But first, make sure you like this video and subscribe to this channel. about this experiment next time you're using a plastic bag take an extra couple of minutes and have a go at it with this outstanding science experiment all you need is an extra plastic bag because you won't use this one after you're done with this experiment and a couple of spare pens or pencils These are the materials we will require. Water, a sealable plastic bag, pencils or pens, and food color. And remember kids, always have an adult present as you're doing this experiment. Safety first! All the time. So now you're ready. Yes. Ready to start? Yes. So what I'm going to want you to do here, mm -hmm. so we open the bag. Open the baggie. Uh huh. The baggie, the baggie, baggie. Then just hold it well enough. Then I'm going to pour it in water. Is it getting full? Yes. Okay. That's good enough. Can you close it? Can I close it? Oh, okay. Let's see. Can I close. So, uh huh. Just to make this a bit interesting, I'm going to add in some food color to make the water a different color. Don't you think so? Everything is better in color. Shake the baggie. Okay. Don't shake too much. Let's go. So, then we're going to put these pencils through the bag and the bag is not going to leak. This is going to happen. <laughs> it's going to happen. So, uh -huh. let's make sure that the bag is closed quite and there's no air. So, tight. Quite. Quite completely. Quite. Then hold it as hold it. I have this to make sure that no water. Hold it. Uh huh. So hold it high for me. So let me see. There we go. Can you see? <laughs> Is it leaking? Do you want me to poke another bag? Another, another yes. Bag? yes. Okay. Go. What? The plastic bag is made from polymers. A polymer is a molecule made from joining together many small molecules. Poking the pencils through the bag only separates the molecule chains of the polymers in the plastic bag. It doesn't break the chains, thus holding the water in the bag. I hope you at home are able to make your very own leak-proof bag. Wow! All we have for you today. See you next time on Funky Science. Bye! Bye.